Malta Citizenship by Investment 2019 new status symbol. This video shows the cost, the benefits and the time frame of obtaining a Malta Citizenship by Investment 2019. The Malta passport has become the latest status symbol. Some of my Arab clients have become passport collectors. They have a few of them. Since immigration policies are becoming more restrictive everywhere, freedom of movement is key factor for international business people. A Malta passport is the most reputable passport money can buy. This video shows how Malta Citizenship by Investment program works, including the latest developments. Stay tuned! Caputo and Partners SwissBankingLawyers.com We fight for your money. Hello, I am Enzo Caputo, the Swiss banking lawyer, the founder of the boutique law firm Caputo & Partners and the owner of the blog SwissBankingLawyers.com, the place where international business people find tips and solutions about global asset protection, asset diversification, offshore banking, international private banking and how to pay less tax. Malta Citizenship by Investment Program was introduced in 2014 and it's approved by the European Union. The official name is Malta Individual Investor Program, IIP. It offers a second passport and citizenship option to families wishing to relocate to a European Union country. The Malta passport by investment granted by this program is valid for life. It can be transferred to future generations by descent. Malta has a strong economy and a very stable political system. The country is a member of the European Union since 2004 and it's part of Schengen since 2007. Multi citizens have freedom of movement and direct access to the markets in the European Union. Malta sold over 1,500 passports. How can I get Malta citizenship? What are the requirements? You should be 18 years old. You must provide proof of economic self sufficiency for the Malta Residence Permit and the Malta Citizenship by Investment Program. Economic self-sufficiency means showing an annual income of at least 100,000 euros. That's the same requirement as per Malta Residency by Investment or Malta Investor Visa. You have to submit a clean criminal record. That's very important requirement. Checks are conducted with the International Criminal Court, Interpol and other sources. If you made a criminal offence, don't hide it. They will discover your offence. Tell us, we will solve your problem. The due diligence standards are very high. Applicants must pass the fit and proper test. You and your family must be in excellent health conditions. How much does Malta citizenship cost? What are the financial contributions and investments? The following contribution must be effected within four months after the Malta IPP letter of approval in principle. You must do a non-refundable contribution of 650,000 euro and invest 150,000 euro in a government bonds. Contribution and investments can be done after the approval in principle of the demand. The spouse and minor children must contribute with 25,000 euro per individual. Unmarried children from 18 to 26 pay 50,000 euro. Dependent parents and grandparents pay 50,000 euro each. What's better, property acquisition or renting an apartment? You must purchase a house or apartment for 350,000 euro or rent a house for 16,000 euro per year with a five-year contract. Please be advised that the property can be rent out. Properties acquired with the Portugal Golden Visa can be rent out, not in Malta. You have to invest 150,000 euro in government bonds and shares and keep the investment for five years. Evidence of the source of funds must be presented. The level of source of funds investigations is much higher today. The total cost depends on the number of family members. If you rent or buy real estate, due diligence, passport and banking fees, the non-refundable contribution amounts between 650,000 euro and 850,000 euro. The non-refundable contribution is higher if you rent real estate. What are the residency requirements? As soon you have your property, you receive an e-residence card. You can use this card as evidence to demonstrate your genuine link to Malta. 12 months after having kept the residence in Malta, you receive the citizenship. 
The law in Malta defines the resident as an intention to reside in Malta at least for 183 days per year. If you are resident in Malta before receiving the e-residence card, you already satisfied the residency requirements and you can subsequently become a citizen of Malta much faster. To receive citizenship as fast as possible, you can start a nominee residency in Malta. You pay 5,000 euro and additional 1,000 euro for each family member to the National Development Fund and Social Fund. Do I need to speak Maltese? No language tests in Maltese or English are imposed for the Malta Citizenship by Investment Program. There is a risk of losing the passport through revocation. If you don't respect the requirements, the Malta passport can be revoked. If you sell the property before five years, your citizenship can be cancelled and the passport revoked. Is Malta a member of the European Union? Since 2004, Malta is a full member of the European Union. EU freedom of movement treaties are allowing Maltese citizens to work live and study in any EU country, including Switzerland. How about Schengen countries? Since 2007, Malta is part of the Schengen area. 26 European Union countries are accessible without going through border control. In addition, you can travel to Norway, Switzerland, Iceland and Liechtenstein, being members of the European Free Trade Association. Do I need a lawyer representing me in the Citizenship by Investment Programme? Contrary to the Golden Visa Portugal program, applying for the Citizenship by Investment program on your own is not allowed. The engagement of an accredited representative is imperative to get the application started. Contacting a certified individual is the only way to start a successful procedure. As real estate brokers in Malta are usually paid by the seller, you should always be careful. Now, I'm alerting you. Don't throw money out of the window with a fraudulent real estate agent. Real estate agents are in a conflict of interest situation. Some real estate agents are offering overpriced properties for exactly 350,000 euro to comply with the Malta Citizenship by Investment Program. The market value is far below 350,000 euro. Therefore, you should hire an independent lawyer to deal with the real estate acquisition. Investing in a local independent real estate lawyer is an excellent investment for finding the best property covering your needs and expectations. Most of our clients hire a lawyer recommended by Caputo Partners. A local independent real estate lawyer is in a position to guide you through the real estate opportunities and finding the property of your dreams. Don't be a victim of cheap scammer. Be prudent and watch out. A housing prices in Malta are constantly going up. The real estate investment should be made in areas with high growth potential. Therefore, having a local matador knowing the market on your side is so important. Please be informed that you must keep your real estate investment for five years. We are more than happy to give you an overview on the most promising real estate investments available. Write an email and we will touch base with you to discuss your most promising real estate investment in Malta. Do I qualify for a Maltese passport? You need a genuine link to Malta. You have to maintain a genuine connection to Malta to comply with the Malta residence permit requirement. A commitment to a minimum physical presence is required. Your official agent will collect an official approval on your effective residence duration. If you are fulfilling the above condition, imposed by the Malta Citizenship by Investment Program, you and your family are entitled to receive the passport one year after the filing has started. Here are the five steps for obtaining the Malta passport. The infographic shows the five steps needed for the Malta passport. The main applicant must be in good standing. The contribution of 650,000 euro, the investment in government bonds of 150,000 euro and the property transaction must be accomplished. The genuine connection must be evidenced. If these five steps are accomplished after one year, you will be the owner of a Malta passport. What are the benefits of Malta Citizenship by Investment Program? Freedom of movement is the main benefit. In case of emergency or revolution in the home country, you can fly to Malta and reside at any time. There is no requirement to reside all the time in Malta. Visa-free travel to 182 countries, including the European Union, USA and Canada. You have the right to live, study and work in 28 EU countries. Norway, Iceland, Switzerland and Liechtenstein are included. 
parents, spouse, minor children, unmarried dependent adult children below 27 years of the main applicant are entitled to be included. Descendants are automatically entitled to receive citizenship. Malta has no data exchange with the home country. This is important for nationals of countries not allowing dual citizenship, such as China. Malta is a safe country. You can live a European and Mediterranean lifestyle in a low-tax country. The citizenship will be approved after four months processing duration if you already reside in Malta. The applicants have important tax advantages as their foreign income is not taxed due to the non-domicile tax status. The first track resident permits can be obtained within one to three weeks, including Schengen mobility for 18 months. The Malta citizenship it's in a European Union citizenship by investment. European Union passport will be issued after a total of 12 months from the day of the first residency. If you like the video, show it to us now and push the like button. If you like this information just like this, make sure to not miss the new videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel now. Click the subscribe button and ring the bell. Let me speak about a very important tax advantage as a new citizen, the resident not domicile tax status. Malta absorbed the UK tax system based on domicile and the effective residence, not based on citizenship like in the USA. Residence for tax purposes is based on the intention to stay in Malta for indefinite time or at least 483 days per year. A passport issued based on the Malta Citizenship by Investment Program does not have any tax consequences. If you remove your primary residence in Malta, you can retain the privileged tax status of a non-domiciled person and therefore benefit of extremely advantaged tax treatment. Non-domiciled tax residents are taxed on a remittance basis. That means that non-domiciled with primary tax residents are not taxed in Malta for foreign source income not received in Malta and not on capital gains realized outside Malta, whether remitted or not. Subject to taxation is income and capital gain realized in Malta. The corporate tax in Malta is 35% per special tax schemes applied to non-resident company owners. If you own a company in Malta as a non-resident, you can reduce the corporate tax for your company to 5%. If you want to take tax advantages, and reduce taxation by using companies in Malta for the business setup, you should definitely contact me to explore the options. There is a tax on property? No. After five years, the property in Malta can be sold completely, exempt from tax. Let me give you five additional tax benefits. No inheritance taxes, no real estate duties, no net worth on or wealth taxes, no municipal taxes, rates or real estate taxes. There are double taxation treaties with more than 60 countries. Malta is definitely a tax paradise. How fast can I become a citizen of Malta? Let me give you some information on the application timeline. If you do reside in Malta, the minimum amount of time to become a citizenship by investment are 12 months. If you already stay in Malta, you can become a passport within four to six months. On day one, the filing of the application with the identity Malta by an accredited person takes place. Within 90 days, the identity Malta confirms that the application is formally correct and the supporting documents accepted. Within 120 days, the approval in principle arrives under the conditions that the investment obligation are executed. Within 145 days, the National Development and Social Fund contribution must be made by this time. Within 240 days, the final compliance is accomplished. The applicant must submit the evidence for the investment in bonds of 150,000 euro and the real estate investment for minimum 350,000 euro. After the oath of allegiance is done, the authorities will issue the naturalization certificate and the biometric passport. 12 months since the first day of residence in Malta are required to get the naturalization certificate and the passport. What are the latest updates regarding passport by investment? The source of funds investigation is very strict. The Malta Citizenship by Investment Program is refusing applicants having difficulties in producing the source of funds documentation. Since today, more than 1,400 citizenships have been granted to nationals of more than 40 countries. Based on the pressure from the European Union, Malta has become stricter with the source of funds investigations. The Malta Citizenship by Investment Program is fully approved by the European Union. This year, 
Malta decided to extend the citizenship by investment program beyond the quota of 1,800 applicants. The price for real estate in Malta is skyrocketing. A tailor-made real estate investment can be a very attractive investment if the real estate property is located in a promising location. The Malta Citizenship by Investment Program is considered the most reputable citizenship by investment program beside Cyprus Citizenship by Investment. Last year, two new citizenship by investment programs were born. Moldova and Montenegro are offering citizenship by investment programs since 2018. The Montenegro Citizenship by Investment Program is very attractive because Montenegro will be part of the European Union in 2025. A new Armenia Citizenship by Investment Program will come up during the current year 2019. The Armenian authorities are working on it. They are drafting the laws. For the moment, only the President of Armenia can issue a passport against a substantial investment into the country. Watch out! This is an alert. Don't ask the president for a passport. Such a passport has no legal basis. It's much better to wait until the laws for the official Armenia citizenship by investment program are in force. A passport exceptionally given by the president may be revoked by the subsequent president. It's crucial for your own protection to accept second citizenship if there is an official law supporting your passport. Insider information just like this cannot be found in university, in libraries and not on the internet. If you would like further information on offshore banking, international asset protection and tax optimization I only share with subscribers, sign our boutique law firm's letter. Based on that information you will save more money and expand your business faster than your competitors. Check our educational video blog on our website where you will find the links to more of our easy to read articles. If you are interested in knowing more about international asset protection for protecting your savings from rapacious authorities, give me a call now. I will give you the latest updates on citizenship by investment programs, golden visa and more insider information. Grab your mobile phone now and dial plus 414-421-24404. Give me a call. Be rich and stay rich. Have a wonderful day.